Hey everyone, Grand Chisel Forehead here, New Bethans Boulevard, and today I'm going to try Cream Tea Pocky Sticks. This is another Eid episode. And, oh shit, I'm video. Yeah, this is going to be Green Tea Pocky Sticks. I'm going to try these out and see what they taste like for the first time ever. And, video maker, movie maker, was really pissing me off. So I tried to do it with movie maker screwed up at least I bought two of these. This is why I buy two. So you know that if something like movie maker asks me over, I have something as backup. So I'm going to open this up and see how it tastes. Okay. You see the back of it, right? That's what it's supposed to look like. I guess. So, these are, I guess, midi chocolate pocky, I guess. I don't know. That's the little bag they come in. Tell me to open right here or something like that. So, I'll do that. And. Yeah, this is really, really interesting packaging. So these are what they look like. Hopefully you can still hear me with the music that's playing right now. I'm not gonna say what type of music it is, but it's in the background. I hope you guys can hear me. Yada yada yada. But enough about that. Let's try this. Hmm. Pretty yummy. It tastes like the like, green tea cat that I reviewed a couple weeks ago. When Movie Maker wasn't screwing me over. Ugh, Movie Maker, Movie Maker. Why must you torture me? This is not me whining and bitching about Movie Maker, this is me doing an honest review. And, this green tea pocky? It's actually not bad. It is really, really good. The texture on it, like just the you look at it, and I'll show you one of the four, I guess. If you look at the textures of it, it just it looks so smooth. It looks, yeah, and you can barely even taste the biscuit when you're eating the coated bit of it, the coated top. Which is actually a good thing because, like, you don't really want to hear that. You don't really want to taste that. And, yeah. All this stuff right here, all this that I'm playing, like, I'm messing around with it. It's actually not bad. And, it just, it tastes so darn good that I want to have another right now. The texture of it, really smooth, of course. The like, little biscuit sticks that it comes with are just normal pocky sticks. They're just coated. They taste like whatever they're supposed to taste like. Remember that? Yeah, honestly. This is really, really good stuff. I bought it at the Cabini, the Convinia store downtown. At a Japanese store where I bought the green tea, the, not the green tea Kit Kats, the aloe vera drink, and the Otonin Kit Kats, which I will do a review on. But I think I'm going to try and aim for February for it. I don't know when exactly in February, but I think it will be in around the, like, around Valentine's Day, maybe, but, 
enough about me. I just know that I gotta give these a really solid 9 out of 10. A really solid 9. Like, they're that good to me. But, uh, there's nothing else I could think of that would be this good. Like, you could always try and find something that you'd really like and try and do something like this. I don't even know what I'm saying. I just know that they're, they're really, really good. I would actually recommend them if you were to go buy them. I Maybe if you want to do a review like this, buy two of whatever you're going to buy. Unless you have some really, and that's only if you're going to do Movie Maker or YouTube videos using the recording option. I better get off of here because I look like a mess and I look like I just got out of bed. And I did an hour ago. And I haven't done really anything. So I'm going to get out of bed. Well, I'm, I'm going to get out of here. Get off of here. Sign off, whatever. And yeah, I'm going to go about my day. I'm going to go about my business. So this is me. Branch on the forehead. Green tea pocket sticks. Whatever. Peace out.